All right, we've got the iPhone 12 in the 12 Pro in, and here it is, the iPhone 12 in blue. You've got the new design, kind of like the iPhone 5 back in the day, with these flat edges compared to the rounded edges that we've seen on iPhones since 2014. On the left side, you have the vibrate switch and volume buttons as always, along with the SIM tray. On the right side, there's the power button, and then this thing right here. It's actually to help get a better 5G connection. Let's see what else is inside the box. You've got your typical paperwork, and then you have a lightning to USB-C cable inside of the box. That is it. There there is no power adapter, so if you want one that works with the included USB-C cable, that's going to cost you $19. The back of the phone looks mostly the same as last year's iPhone 11, but through magnetic viewing film, it's a different story. And that's because there are a bunch of magnets underneath for a feature that Apple is calling MagSafe that allows you to clip compatible accessories right onto the back of the phone. 